Good morning, YouTubers. Welcome back to my channel. Uh, this is Joseph Magi, author of Playing Card Divination and Fortune Telling, The Magi Method. You can find the book worldwide on Amazon and Kindle and paperback versions. You can find the full color card deck used here on Etsy slash Magi Method. If you like the video, please subscribe. All right, so Selena Gomez has been hospitalized for an emotional breakdown. Again, this is seven days ago. Selena Gomez has entered a mental health facility after an emotional breakdown over recurring issues that followed her kidney transplant. Okay, so she's only 26 years old. She already had a kidney transplant. She has um, lupus. Uh, she was recently hospitalized for a second time with a plummeting white blood cell count. Okay, that's related to kidney transplant. And the emergency threw Selena into a downward emotional spiral. When doctors told her she couldn't leave the hospital, the sources said she had an emotional breakdown and attempted to rip I, the IV tubes out of her arms. Okay, so according to TMZ, uh, she, this 26-year-old singer has gone to the hospital twice in the past couple of weeks. Uh, after her initial treatment, they decided to up the game and they sent her to an East Coast uh, psychiatric facility. Okay, so Gomez was released days later but readmitted late last week due to continued health issues. The hospital, hospitalization drove Gomez to have an emotional breakdown where she had a meltdown and freaked out when she wasn't allowed to leave. She is currently undergoing dialectical behavior therapy, which um, di dialectical behavior therapy is to help you uh, be stronger and to deal with to strengthen distress tolerance. That is what dialectical behavior therapy. Okay, uh, it sounds kind of like, you know, you offer that that thing where you offer the dog or the, the rabbit a carrot and the carrot salivates. It's creating um, responses, you know, you're trying to get her to have uh, certain responses to certain stimuli. Anyway, uh, I would also note that Bieber, Bieber and Baldwin... Uh, Justin Bieber, the Biebs, and Haley Baldwin uh, were married in a civil ceremony September 13th. I find the timing of this very interesting. Let's start out with a, a mini Celtic and see what we see. Okay, Selena Gomez is hospitalized for an emotional breakdown. What's going on? Let's just get a general overview of what's going on with Selena. Consider key events. Heart, Executioner, Devil, wow, 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 she's in a dark place. Okay, so what, what do we got in general for Selena? We've got Executioner and Devil. These are two of the worst cards. Okay, so she's reacting to things. She's reacting to key events, okay? Uh, her health and Justin was married. Her, her true love, uh, Justin Bieber, was married another woman, okay? So she's reacting to key events and love. The basis of this is love. She's not feeling loved. That's interesting. Behind, we have the executioner. Uh, this can be the executioner cuts. She can be a cutter. She can be a self-abuser. Okay. Uh, on her mind, she has the devil. So there's like self-abuse, destructive behaviors. On her mind is the devil. She's She wants to hurt herself. She is thinking very, very, very dark thoughts. The devil is very malicious. The devil doesn't think things out. The devil, you know, like Britney Spears, when she was going through all that stuff, she just cut all her hair off and went just crazy. Uh, that's what's going on with Selena. And 
I'm not sure how old, um, you know, the other one was, Brittany was, maybe around the same age, 26. Uh, that's the age when the MK Ultra children um, lose it. Okay, so in the future, this is a little bit more hopeful. She's got the four-leaf clover. She's working it out. She's, she's working it out. Um, let's look at this. Let's, let's look at some of these things. What is this executioner? Is it like self-harm? Uh, is it, what is it? I mean, is she going to go into a school and shoot a bunch of people? I mean, what is this executioner? I think it's self-harm. See if we can get a little more information on it. What is this executioner? Many hands, high tower, mustard seed, roadblock. Okay, so we got hand in hand, high tower, and mustard seed. What is it? Well, it's um, fame. Everybody, it's her. It's she's she's on the high tower. She's she's raised up above everyone else. Everyone. You know, she's this cute little girl, and she's she's world famous, and she's way up here on the high tower where everybody can see her, and everybody's pulling on her all the time, and Mustard Seed is messages. Uh, f the fame and the constant uh, attention that she receives is too much for her. That's what this executioner is. Interestingly, that's not at all what I thought it was until I threw some clarifiers. Uh, so the fame is just too much for her. And this adds, you know, the constant attention. She can't, she can't go to the store without the paparazzi chasing her. And it's just, it's overwhelming. The pressures of being a world famous star uh, are overwhelming. She's just a person, okay? And you need to give her a little bit of space and a little bit of room. Uh, what's this devil? Okay, what's this devil? Uh, what is this devil? Butterfly. Heart. Wow. And inheritance. Oh my goodness. Three is uh, Ace of Diamonds. So what is the heart? What is this devil? Butterfly. Love. Beauty. Butterflies in her stomach. Lovers. Justin Bieber. Okay. Lovers revealed. And her feelings about this. And her desire for... To establish her life and have a family and be a normal person. She has... Here she is. She's one of these people who has everything in the whole world. And like any normal person, she wants to be married. She wants to have children. Okay. And Justin Bieber just married Haley Baldwin in secret, okay? And it's killing her. It's, it's just killing her. It's killing her. It's killing her. How bad is her health from... from her physical illnesses? From her kidney transplant... How bad is it? Her kidney transplant, her lupus. How bad is her health? How much of a role did this play? Her physical health. How bad is that? Goodness gracious. This poor girl has a lot of troubles. Okay, so how bad is her physical health? Incubus, succubus, snake, finger of God. This is a bad relationship. She has a bad relationship with her health. Sixes are always relationships. Uh, it's very difficult for her, and it just keeps affecting her life. It just keeps coming. It just keeps swooping down at the wrong moment and just messing everything up. So she's having a lot of emotional turmoil, and then this triggers her physical ailments as well. And she just has, she just feels like this is not my body. This, 
you know, this terrible body of death that she's living in, it's just bad for her. So her, her emotional health is terrible and her physical health is terrible at the same time, both at the same time. 12 and 6, 18, 25, 7 hearts. This is the direction for quite some time. So she's having the perfect storm of... Uh, she's having the perfect storm. Now it's said that she suffers from depression for five years. Okay, just generally. How generally depressed is she? You know, there's general depression and then there's specific I love Justin Bieber depression and I can't believe he ran off and married that girl uh, that girl Haley Baldwin I mean what the heck so how generally uh, depressed is she because allegedly she's been suffering with depression for five years city trinity home Angel. Let's move that up. Okay. So allegedly, you know, they the media makes excuses. They hate Trump constantly, but for others they make just constant excuses and they walk in lockstep. Goosing lockstep, the media does. Okay, so how much truth is there to this general depression thing? Okay, well, she's got the angel. The angel is innocent. The angel is pure. It's not bad. Trinity, everything's working together. Home is her physical body and her relationships. She's pretty much okay. It's a, it's a little overwhelming. She's got a lot on her mind. Uh, she's really got a lot on her mind. Okay, but otherwise, generally speaking, she is emotionally healthy. So this is specific events that are triggering this meltdown. Specific events triggered this meltdown. Let's ask one more question. Is she totally in love with Justin Bieber? Uh, no, I mean, I got that. That is, uh, in, in my previous one, she is totally in love with him, but she doesn't want him back. She doesn't want him back. Uh, she's totally in love with him, but she doesn't want him back. Uh, and that's what I saw in a previous spread. Okay, when I did Selena and Justin, uh, it, it, it could be, okay, uh, in that reading, I thought I interpreted the cards as she doesn't want him back, but it could also just be that it's not possible because... I didn't know it at the time. He's going to run off and marry Haley. Okay, so that's probably what's going on. That she actually does want him back. He's the love of her life. Uh, and they're very young. And they were together for a very long time. Uh, okay, so let's recap. What have we got going on here? Generally, this emotional breakdown. She's reacting to very specific per uh, circumstances in her life, it caused her to to uh, melt down, freak out, and have an emotional breakdown. Okay, and these these specific circumstances, Nine of Hearts is very specific. Key events, she's reacting to key events in her love life. Okay, behind we have the Executioner, very dark card. She is overwhelmed by the constant attention, the constant media and fan attention, it just makes it really, really, really difficult for her. The King of Spades is very organized, okay, very systematic, very organized. So there's a whole system working against her. She feels that the whole system of her life is working against her, the King of Spades. She's having very dark thoughts on top. Uh, the devil, what is it? Lovers, son, the lovers are revealed and her feelings uh, about, you know, establishing her life as a human being. Okay, not as a rich, famous person, but as a human being. She needs love just like everybody needs love. Okay, it's about, this is about Justin and Haley. Uh, and she's just, just killed by it. It's just, it just kills her. It just kills her. 
How is her physical health? Terrible. It's awful. Uh, everything is happening for her all at once. Uh, she's like divorced. She has like a bad relationship and is divorced from her body. So she's getting it all. She's getting the emotional breakdown. She's getting the physical breakdown. Everything all at once. Uh, the media walking in lockstep says, well, she's been, she's been depressed for five years. Uh, is there truth to this? Just generally, oh, it's... Uh, it's chemical. We need to just feed her drugs or something, okay? And that is never the answer, okay? My opinion as, as a cartomancer and not a doctor, uh, I don't think you should be giving people drugs uh, to not, long, not longer than like a day or two. And I personally don't take any drugs. Uh, that doesn't mean I believe as Tom Cruise does, but I don't take any drugs, not even prescription drugs, not even aspirin, okay? So how is her general depression... Her five year, and I'm old by the way, and I don't take anything. Okay. Uh, occasionally I'll have a beer, but that's like once a month. Uh, okay. So, how is her five year <clears throat> depression generally? She's generally quite good. She's generally quite good. Uh, her, she's in a good place. She's got good habits. Everything is clicking along, but she gets overwhelmed. She gets overwhelmed. Life can be a little overwhelming, and I totally get it. You know, this is me too. Life is just can just be a little overwhelming. Um, I, I feel sorry for Selena. She's a beautiful girl. Uh, I, I think we should all pray for her health. Uh, but she's got to work this thing out. Her feelings, she's just overwhelmed by her feelings about Justin and Haley. And, you know, she was really blindsided. Oh, okay, and that's why they did it. That's why they did it in secret. That's how I see it. I'm Joseph Magi, author of Playing Card Divination, Fortune Telling the Magi Method. You can find the book worldwide on Amazon and Kindle and paperback versions. Find the full color card deck used here on Etsy slash Magi Method. If you like the video, please subscribe.